started on eight count, Lindy Hop. So we did the footwork first. Um, forwards and backs, five, six, seven, eight, back and forward, forward, back, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four. Then we did our flip flops. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six. Um, I was just thinking, how do we do the side to side? <laughs> then we did our oh, side to side, so we're up to triple, oh that works. Foot. <laughs> we're up to <laughs> triple, we're up to step triple. I'm not sure if you're going to shout so much. Oh. <laughs> what you can also do is just do it with your step steps. Step, step, triple step, 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 triple step, 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 triple step. And then we put it all together and we did... Um, we did it all together, like this. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, and four. We did our flip flops. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. And we did a guy in front. Boom, ha. We did a guy in front with hesitations. Back, forward, back, forward, back, and triple step. We also did um, hesitations in the forwards and backs. Do, you can do the exaggerated ones, or you can do the, um, the really little ones. I mean, the ones where the other foot doesn't move. Boom. Very different feel, but quite cool. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and we did... Girl in front. Girl in front. So you have to muscle up for that one a little bit, guys. And we also can do hesitations here. And then we did a scoot with the guy in front. In close, staying in close. Just put it up, da 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 da. Then we did it open. Scoot, da 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 da. Rock, step, triple step, do da 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 da. Um, so we'll do it all again in another direction with counts. Okay. <laughs> so we face this way. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, and six, and seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, and six, and seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, and six, and seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and that's what we did. Well done, guys. Thank you. And thank you to John for teaching with me. Level two. Richard talked with me tonight, we um, went over, we actually spent quite a lot of time on what we worked on last week um, so that it looked better and hopefully felt better and then we worked on some flying Charleston's so we didn't do too much but we did a lot on technique and feeling and, and just making it feel nice. Yeah. So we started with, uh, with our flying Charleston's with uh, a rock step, so we ended up going rock step, kick step, kick turn, kick step, kick turn. Kick, step, kick, turn, kick, step. Now, if we show you from this angle, yeah, you'll see that we have quite a bit of space between us. Kick, turn, kick, step, kick, turn. And I'm kind of just holding on just long enough. I turn myself and I turn her. We kick through. So I'm not trying to kind of lead her all the way back around and hold on to there because it's, we'll lose our balance. One, two, deep, da, da, da. And turn, let go, kick, step. Turn, every time we connect, we're actually just pulling away from each other a little bit, which helps us connect better. We're not like forcibly doing it, it just is sort of how our bodies are moving and the momentum we've created that creates that yeah. away feeling. You'll see that the hand in the middle doesn't, um, doesn't seesaw between, doesn't saw between us. Yeah. I'm not trying to pull her towards me. Yeah. I'm not trying to let her pull um, my hand towards yeah. her. The, the hand kind of stays neutrally in the middle and we both pull 
away from it a little bit, which is really hard to show you on yeah. camera. But you may have noticed when we did that, we didn't do it like this. We actually did it with our bodies, bodies yeah. and our hands kind of stayed there. It's just that we didn't allow them to come yeah. out of their shoulder sockets. We just really keep our arms down and relaxed, yeah. um, and then just increase the tension by um, matching the energy that we're giving each other. Yeah. And that part of that I get from the feeling through my kicks. Yes. Um, little uh, little shapes that we make to help this movement. One, two. So when I do my kick to the side there, see how I anchor my body back here as I kick to the side? It helps to um, anchor her position so that she knows that we're coming back this way. You can do it upright, but um, as the music gets faster and that you, you'll find that you'll change, because you can sort of go one, two, three, da, 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 da. but when you really anchor back through that, you can, you're almost catching her back there, so she's a little bit further out than you are. And it has the feeling of flying, because they are flying Charleston's. Yeah. Um, uh, so from there we then um, add... So we, uh, oh yeah, yeah, so let's go a little bit over here. So if we've got one of these things, da, 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 we can then kick through and go back and <laughs> flying this way. way. Catch her. <laughs> so I'm constantly, when that happens, I've got a hawk eye onto my lead because I don't know what he's going to do. He might just make me do the length of it turning, and every time I turn, he comes back and he connects me and he gives me a little guide to yeah. turn again. Um, so that when he catches me, I know something different is about to happen. Yeah, um, and the, the technique of all the pattern that we use there is we're kicking kicking towards the direction that we're going. Kick, step, kick, step, kick. And the other thing that I do is I just try to keep my hand out so that as I come through it will just naturally connect up without me having to do an awful lot. I do kind of keep an eye out here. So if we've got this here. So I don't have to do too much to be able to just pick up a hand. And I'm not trying to push it through. I'm not going one, two, turn. Because uh, <laughs> right. that'll, that'll, that'll change the energy. I want yeah. her to do it at the same rate as me. Kind of set me off on yeah. an angle that's So really I'm weird. just thinking about doing it myself and having a little bit of a frame, a little bit of connection, so that that arm is not moving like this. I'm just turning. Yeah. I'm just turning like that. And we want to keep our arms where they were follows because he knows where he left them. If we suddenly move them, then he's got no yeah. show to catch it because he's expecting it to be where he left it. Jink, jink, there it is. Ha, there it is. Yeah. Um, and that was sort of the yeah. main stuff that we talked about tonight. We'll get into more of that stuff. And it's really fun when you start really getting it and playing with it. And um, start getting the fast music and getting your kicks on. <laughs> yes, there is a lot more technique. <laughs> That's just a little bit of it. I'll see you guys. Even Adam had a garden. Everything.